<laughs> She's I, not holding back. <laughs> I don't hold back. I don't hold back. I'm, I'm right on it. Parenting do or don't. Do or don't go through your 29-year-old son's phone. No. Mm. <laughs> I would hope not. I've, ne any, I've never done any, that. No. Any parent Absolutely that's doing not. that. That's a little, no, I've no, a little weird. Not even 29, even 20. I, I would never do that. Okay, that's good. What about like tracking? Cause like I've had, I used to get in trouble when my parents like track on find my iPhone if I was lying about where I was. Did you ever do that? Never done that. Mm. I have so, my mom, so much she, she, she would just, she, you would just always text me. Like if you were worried about something, you just text and you know, Jack and yeah, I would answer or whatnot. Like yeah, if he was out late, I'd say, you know, are you okay? I would, hi Dusty. I would just say, hello, how are you? know, really are you okay? <laughs> I just say, you know, just to, as, a, as a concerned parent, I would just say, are you okay? Um, and that's it, but I would never track. I would never do any of that, no. Do or don't stay friends with your son's ex in real life or on Instagram? Well, you know what, when you say ex, I mean, he's had like, I mean, he really hasn't had that many relationships. Um, what are you talking about? <laughs> no, I'm talking girlfriends, girlfriends, girlfriends. Girls no, I, that you I dated is a different it. story, but I'm just saying girlfriends, you haven't had that many, but you know, dates? Yes, you've had dates. And yes, the girls that he has, there's some of them I have. Yes, absolutely. I have stayed friends with them. I would say I would say Jack more with Catherine, I would say, is the one that you're probably Yes, with. especially, yes. I Jack is my youngest son and um, his first girlfriend from high school, you know, we've stayed friends and, you know, we she comes by, by and visits me and we're still, you know, they're still really good friends. Do or don't get a little too tipsy when your son brings home a new girl. I would say no. <laughs> no, not no. not tipsy. No, I wouldn't say I, I like my, I love my wines. Don't get me wrong, but I wouldn't say I get tipsy. Mm -mm. Do or don't <laughs> watch that. old seasons of your watch old seasons of Peter's on The Bachelor or Bachelor. No. Mm. Yeah, I don't think we. Yeah, we just watched it that one time, and that was it. Yeah. Do or don't give unsolicited advice to your son about someone he's seeing. Um, you know, I have in the past. Yes, I have. No, you know, not, you know, definitely, something definitely that he has not seen. Judgment. I mean, you saw that on the show. I mean, I think the show was a prime example of it. You know, I gave him advice. I think that would be, you know, saying yes to that, don't you, bud? Yeah, no, for sure. You definitely. I, I mean, I, I always throw, you know, ideas off here and see what you think. And like I said, there's no one's judgment or just, you know, no one that I trust more than my mom to just have my back and you know not leave me down the wrong road and just be brutally honest to me so it's something that i love what is that oh, i'm always as big as critic i have to tell you and everything you know i always say yes this and yes that whatever but i you know like i said i'm very transparent and and that's who i am biggest fan and biggest critic that's that's important yeah what is that balance though of like the unsolicited advice versus if he's if whether Peter or your other son is asking you for advice or whether they maybe haven't come to you yet, when do you step in? Like, when is the time to be like, I'm not waiting for you to ask? <laughs> She's I'm, not holding back. <laughs> I don't hold back. I don't hold back. I'm, I'm right on it. You know, I, she, she has I something to something, say, she's saying it. Huh? I said, you have something to say, you're saying it. I don't I don't think you've, <laughs> you can't hold back. Like you can't be fake or, or no. like you, you are just so 100% yourself all the time. Exactly, exactly.